In South Sudan, a mobile court that started last year is bringing justice to victims of various crimes. It's all part of efforts to complement a UN mission, a strategy rather, of tackling serious crimes such as sexual and gender-based violence. One by one, the accused arrived in the town of Malakal in northeastern South Sudan for hearing. On this day, the trial is about a sexual assault case involving a four-year-old girl. The suspect is a 26-year-old man, a resident of the United Nations Protection Site in Malakal. The first accused Albino Simon Omot criminal case is under Article 396 of sexual assault on a four-year-old child. It was a serious crime and with a sentence of three years imprisonment. He was lucky. This is a sign to would-be criminals that anybody involved in such criminal acts will face the same judgment. Convict Albino Simon Omot, you are here by sentence to one imprisonment for three years. Satisfied with the sentence, the affected breathed a sigh of relief. I am very happy with the sentence because the law has taken its course. Whatever comes out from the court is always justified. I would like to say that the judgment was right to the accused. Both the victim and the accused have waited for long without trial, and it's good that each one of them now knows their destiny. This is the second time justice has come to Malakal on wings and on the wheels. The first mobile court sat here between the 16th of October and 20th last year. All the five accused persons were convicted and were handed jail terms. The UN mission in South Sudan hopes such justice will be accorded to more victims. Chamrono, CGTN.